Hello everyone and welcome to our blind let's play Sam and Max hit the road for the PC. My name is Lies Bro, this is Sorby's Gaming Channel. Friends? Friends? We've only gone out together three times and already you're telling me you just want to be friends? And already we're off to a start. Who is this guy? You never gave me a chance <sighs> and for that... You'll fry like a pork sausage. Oh, that's not good. Not that I don't like you, it's just that, well, you're too nice a guy, I guess. <laughs> I think I'd rather go out with someone more of the unpredictable. Oh, cool, Iron Man's here. Hello. This doesn't look like the Lincoln Tunnel, Sam. <laughs> Looks to me like a marginally volatile hostage situation, Max. Ooh, does this mean we get to kick some puppy white mad scientist butt? <laughs> Can't think of a reason not to. Let's do it. You'll be of no use, freelance police. With the flip of a lever, my ungrateful lunch date will be reduced to a half cup of disoriented atomic matter. I knew he wasn't a real doctor. <laughs> uh, shall I confront, subdue, and pummel the suspected perpetrator, Sam? Sick him up, little buddy. Oh, wow. Ooh. Ow. Oh. Hey, nice one. Yikes. That's one mean rabbit. Oh, my He's God. A guy, Sam. Can I keep his head for a souvenir? <laughs> I suppose it's ticking. Uh oh. That's, no That's a bomb. Max. It's one damned ugly time bomb. Let's leave this criminal cesspool pronto. Good idea, Sam. Maybe we can ditch the head somewhere while the credits are running. Mind if I drive? <laughs> Not if you don't mind me clawing at the dash and shrieking like a cheerleader. Sam, is pronto a real word? Goodbye, Sam and Max. I'll never forget all you've done here today. You could, like, let her go, guys. Um, guys. Uh, hello. This is This is awkward pause. <laughs> Sam and Max hit the road. Hope you all are having a wonderful, fantastic day today. As we begin a new journey on the channel, and that is with um with these two colorful characters. <laughs> I have never played a Sam and Max game before, but we have done LucasArts games on the channel. Of course, we've done all six Monkey Island games. Day of the Tentacle, Loom, and other point-and-click games that aren't Lucas, but yeah, we've done quite a few of these, and this game has be, uh, has been heavily recommended. And considering the Devil in Me doesn't come out until November 18th, I figured we have some time to play this game. Now, if you're wondering, hey, Flesbird, are you going to do, uh, are, are you going to do, uh, Grim Fandango? The answer is yes, I am going to do Grim Fandango, don't worry. It's just, I don't know how long this game is going to take, and, <laughs> oh, all the pictures here. Call Wayne Alhander Star Wars, yes. Uh, St <laughs> Stormtrooper reference, so good. Is that a full throttle reference? with the bike but yeah we will do Grim Fantango don't worry it's just I, I don't know how much time we have until Double Enemy comes out and when I looked at the time to beat of these games uh, this one seemed to be one of the shorter ones so I feel confident that we'll be able to complete this game and uh, have a lot of fun doing it without needing to rush through it at all. Well, that was a pleasantly understated credit sequence. <laughs> I enjoyed the cheesy retro ambiance. What the hell are you talking about, Max? Sam, either termites are burrowing through my skull, or one of us is ticking. Oops. Oh, yeah. You still got the head? Max, supposed to ditch that. So it doesn't hurt anyone we know or care about. <laughs> out the window, Sam. There's nothing but strangers out there. Wow. Oh my god. 
I hope there was nobody on that bus. <laughs> oh nope, my we god. Were <laughs> that is so messed up. <laughs> Ow, <it did. laughs> Hello? Yes? 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 No. Really? Well, the same to you, Mac. Another confused census taker? Actually, it was the commissioner with another idiotic and baffling assignment. Does it involve wanton destruction? We can only hope. <laughs> Due to the arbitrarily sensitive nature of the mission, we'll be meeting a bonded city courier out on the street. Ooh, smells like a fiercely thickening plot. Man, these guys are just... They are... They are... Messed up! I, I think I may like this game. Alright, so... How do, what in the world do we have here? Uh, look, hand, taste, touch, inventory? It's my little buddy, ready for action. What does this do, though? Is that... I can't use these things together. I can't use these things together. Alright, so I think it's in my inventory, weirdly enough. It's Max. Okay, so I can't use this on myself. This phone represents unhindered contact with the outside world. Until they realize we don't pay the bills. <laughs> this phone represents unhindered All right, contact that's the same. with the outside until they Looks like the uh the dot button is still the same from Monkey Island. Uh I, I you know this is your story based gaming channel, and because of that, I'm gonna be looking at a lot of stuff. I'm gonna be going through trying out things, uh, so but we're gonna be exploring a lot. By the way, this crack on the wall looks vaguely similar to like the head we just threw out the window. Is that an axe? And a knife? Should I ask questions? Which is why there's bullet holes here. We can't look at the bullet hole. It's Max. Nah, I'm not looking at Max, I'm trying to look at the All our money is invested in that rat hole. Vertical silverware storage. Vertical silverware <laughs> storage. I wonder if I hit tab. Okay, if I hit tab, nothing lights up. Okay, space to space bar. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> well, that's one way to throw darts and knife and an axe. <laughs> oh my goodness. Okay, so if I click on him, I can use him. The max card in, but okay. So only if the eye is open can I look at things. We've been through a lot together, this TV and I. I can't pick that up. I can't talk to that. I can't talk to that. Okay, so that's like, oh, <laughs> that's that's cool. I can't use these things together. We've been through a lot together. No, really. I can't pick that up. <laughs> okay, so... So this will probably just use those things, right? Okay, so it looks like I can use the hand or the object. Uh, either or. So I guess I'm controlling him, and I can use uh, Max uh, for various puzzles. That's the tuna fish sandwich I made last spring. Oh! Ah! 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 That's so horrible! Uh, hi, little rat friend. It's Max's roach farm. Oh God, I hate roaches. Have I, I said? I, I know I've said before on multiple games, but I hate roaches. Roaches just make me go ugh. And I know that he's got a roach farm. Ugh. Okay, can't look at any of this. Okay, so we got something there. Can't go back here. What did we just pick up? It's a black light. I'm not really sure what that's for, but we got something. Trying to go across the screen. Our primitive answering machine. It's an 8-track. This is no time for chit-chat. <laughs> this is no time for chit-chat. 
I can't talk to that. Oh, boy, we've got a message. Gee, I hope it's something eerily provocative. Hey, you're the jerk who sideswiped me on the Queensboro Bridge. <laughs> Don't think I didn't get a good look at your long, fluffy ears. See you in court. We may have to go over there and terrify the righteous indignity out of that little fellow. <laughs> That doesn't seem to be anything else. This is no time for chit chat. Well, I picked up a uh, black light. We don't go upstairs. Not since the accident. <laughs> what? Stairs. Apparently, stairs are bad. Flip paper. I don't think I can use it because it looks like I uh, asked for. Yo, you want a piece of me, huh? Well, take a piece of this. Whoa! Whoa. But very true to life. What? And here's one for your old man. Oh. Um. <laughs> Flint's business acumen. Please, Sam, don't use the word acumen again. Oh, I love the smiley face. I loved how they smiled too. That was great. Gratuitous acts of senseless violence are my forte. <laughs> You're such an adorable <laughs> urchin, Max. I don't know. I mean, I, I feel like laughing at this game makes me feel like an evil person now. <laughs> yeah, I can't really do anything here. Let's go downstairs. Uh, if I can go downstairs. I can't use these things together. There we go. Oh, look at the cat. Oh, it's a cute little hypercephalic kitten. I am repulsed by his bulging eyes. <laughs> I won't pick that kitten up. I don't know where he's been. Hey there, little fella. You talking to me? Oh my god. <laughs> I was expecting that. What is all this? Maybe. Are you a cleverly disguised bonded city courier? Maybe. Are you the freelance police? Yes, but don't go blabbing it to everybody. <laughs> I think he's kind of cute, Sam. Can I make a tennis racket out of him? Maybe later, Max. <laughs> right now, we've got a message from the commissioner to collect. Oh, yeah, right. Oh my god, he's coughing up a hairball. Sorry guys, I swallowed your orders for safekeeping. But now I can't seem to hock them back up. So I need to hey feed him something? Fella. You talking to me? Don't get smart with me, bub. Or my partner will floss every last crevice on his body <laughs> with your whiskers. <laughs> That's unsanitary, Sam. What's the other one, Sue? Hey there, little fella. You talking to me? Your head is disturbingly disproportionate to your body. <laughs> it's a vocal cord. You'd be amazed how much room they take up. So what's that last thing? Hey there, little fella. You talking to me? I guess not. Hmm. All right, uh, let's see. Punch? I won't pick that kitten up. I don't know where he's been. I don't indiscriminately use people, except Max. All right, let's use Max. I just love to turn this guy inside out. Oh, that gives me an idea. Uh-oh. <laughs> oh, my God. Jeez. <laughs> oh, my God. <laughs> According to these orders, something bizarre is happening at the carnival. I thought that was the whole point. Maybe we should check it out when we've got nothing better to do, like guinea time. Oh my god, this game is so messed up. It's our orders from the commissioner, telling us to hightail it down to the carnival. Alright, so we need to go down to the carnival. Vehicles will be stolen. Hmm, tells us a lot about the world, doesn't it? Blood spit. Do you just flick that or touch it or... Soiled office space available. Ew. Just a bunch of intoxicated pigeons. Bosco's guns, liquor, baby needs. <laughs> Bosco's guns, liquor, baby needs. Really bad foods. Really bad food. <laughs> I love this car. You're a sick puppy, Sam. Sam is a sick puppy? How do I just see you do? 
The hey, multiple? I don't think Mr. Bosco's voluntarily giving away his money. Oh, I'm real terrified. A dog and a rabbit. Ooh, scary. I used to be scared of the rabbit. Smart ass kid doesn't think we're scary. What do you think about that? <sighs> oh, that's, that's telling him, little buddy. Ooh, that's freaky. <laughs> what? I think that punk learned a valuable lesson, Sam. Me too, Max. I didn't realize that the lower lip could stretch. Oh! Amazing. <laughs> Amazing. <laughs> What's a violent little rabbit? As though they knocked over the uh, the, the meter here. That's a violent little rabbit. Doesn't look like I can do anything with I that. Can't pick that up. I look at him like. <laughs> I was uh, I was gonna say, look at him like creep up to the uh, the window. Hi there, greetings from the USA. So I guess we're going to the carnival first, right? Oh, hey, well apparently you can go wherever the heck you want. Nope, it's all taking me here. Is it all the same? Okay. Weird. Tom Nation and Blimey. He ain't here. So now what do we do? Now? Now we get in the bus and look for him, you idiot. I knew that. Huh? Get out of Mr. Bumpus way, ye partially clad barmids. <laughs> Bumpus. Who was that? That's I a great know, name. But if it weren't for the carefree innocence of this carnival, I'd be breaking his kneecaps. <laughs> You're a demonic little imp, Max. <laughs> yes, he is. I mean, this is a really weird picture back here. Kind of like, uh, what, like a cupid over here? And then this devil in the background? It just looks so weird. Cushman Brothers shows. Yes, weird, exactly. All of oddities. All of oddities. Weird. Weird. <laughs> <Okay>. <laughs> I don't think there's anything about this place that's not very weird. Whoa! Okay, I guess I'm not going that way. Can I go up here? Guess not. Wow, this guy just won't let me go anywhere. the hold up sorry boys we are closed i can't let you in insurance reasons you know so i probably had to give him the uh police orders let us in only your breath nope i want a corn dog <laughs> i want a you corn dog there too the reason than that if you expect me to let you in i want a funnel cake i'll be back i can hardly wait Ah, I want to continue talking to him. Shoot, how'd I get that, uh... There he is. Who are those misanthropes at the gate? Which misanthropes? <laughs> the short one with the bad hairpiece, and the tall one with the dark flinty eyes. Very descriptive. Hey, I just work here. <laughs> Anything else? I uh, know. I'll be back. I can hardly wait. So, given the police orders? Check this out, Jack. We're the freelance police. Here's our authorization to be here. Now let us in before we replace you with a cheap renewable fuel source. <laughs> oh, yes. Let me run this by the boss. Uh, great. Thanks. <laughs> His face. Uh. I guess you can go in. Oh. Be careful. Cannibals can be dangerous to your health. Oh, there's like cannibals can be dangerous to your health. I'm like, yep, that I know that. Needlessly cryptic. <laughs> I'd be peeing my pants if I wore any. Insect Everything land. Seems to be in order here. <laughs> you know, Sam, chicken dumpling. There. How dare you call in the authorities without consulting me? Well, I tried talking to you, but you were off wallowing in your own self-pity. Yeah, but... It's them! Hi, 
I'm Chef Cushman, and this is my brother Burl. Welcome to our carnival. What's left of it? I'm Sam. He's Max. We savagely protect the rights of innocence. <laughs> Even cruelly twisted ones such as yourself. Selves. Whatever. Well, you sound like just the guys to solve our little problem. Walk this way. Awful cast we got so far. See this melted block of ice? How could we miss it? This used to be our main attraction. Your main attraction was a block of ice? Don't be dense. Our main attraction was a genuine, authentic, real life, yeah. Bigfoot. Ooh. On ice. <laughs> hey, let me get this straight. You want us to go traipsing all over the country looking for a soggy Bigfoot? I've never been traipsing before. Does it hurt? <laughs> but Bruno must be returned to us. He's a brutish, ignorant beast with no sense of right or wrong. Hey, who isn't? Besides, he's kidnapped our second main attraction. Is that the block of ice? No, it's Trixie the giraffe neck girl from Scranton. She disappeared at the same time Bruno did. We can only assume that the monster took her when he made his escape. I guess Max and I could search for your missing freaks, but we'll need free run of the carnival to look for clues. Yeah, and free corn dogs. So we can you call over <laughs> ourselves. No problem. Here's an all-day free pass. Nice. Leave everything to us, and we'll have those abominations of nature back in your protective care before you can read the Koran. Didn't he fight Godzilla? <laughs> what? Uh, anyway, we got some really colorful characters in this game so far. Not to mention why a uh, carnival of sorts, but let's go all the way to the left here first. Is that a hand in a jar? Is that a hand in a jar? Oh, it's a Star Wars reference. Yeah, the hand... What is... What? Are you trying to turn on his spigot? Anyway. So this is what happens to unsuccessful third-party presidential <laughs> candidates. I can't pick that up. I can't talk to that. This is a completely unusable thingamabob. Thingamabob. Like that word. Thingamabob. Jesse James' severed hand. And it's still twitching. I got a severed hand. I don't know what I'm going to do with this severed hand, but I got one. Jesse James severed hand. I can't use the, I can't use these things together. All right, I got a uh, severed hand for some unknown reason. All right, it's a rule of an adventure game. Pick everything up, right? Pick everything up that the game lets you pick up. Insect lad. Human enigma. Man or chicken dumpling. <laughs> uh, it's like the insect lad here. How Kafkaesque. I can't pick that up. This is a completely unusable thingamabob. I can't use these things together. No, really. I can't pick that up. Hi? You just buzz me? Hi. <laughs> Hello? <laughs> 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 I wonder what the duck is. Like, is one, uh... Can't talk to this. Like, is the first one basically... He's a nice guy, but sort of a drip. <laughs> so is this basically like questioning nicely? And this is questioning aggressively? And then this is what, wacky? And that's bye? Hello? Yeah. Yeah. Hi. Ah! Man, imagine playing a game where you just heard that noise like the entire playthrough. Ah, oh, man, I, I, oh, jeez. I would go absolutely insane. What the heck is this? A mutated sea monkey. Can we take it? Uh, nope, can't talk to it. Can't use it. Okay. What is this? It's a hair? ridden tuft of Bruno's Sasquatch hair. Yeah. He would make a swell toupee for balding computer programmers. <laughs> Don't be stupid, Max. <laughs> Alright, pick it up. There we go. Okay, now I got... It's a swatch of Bruno's fur and ma... 
we I combine can't the, use these things together? Yeah, well, I just thought hair and, you know, whatever, hand would work. Hello? <laughs> that's, my, that's my favorite one. Hi. <laughs> Hi. <laughs> it's a melted ice block. Bruno the frozenest Bigfoot. The frozenest Bigfoot. Oh, that's great. I can't pick that up. I can't talk to that. I can't use these things together. Ugh. Ah, oh, no, be nice. You know, I dated a Siamese twin poodle once. <laughs> I think that would be twice, Sam. <laughs> what can I do for you? Oh, hello. Uh, that's an interesting neck there. Have you ever thought about surgery? What for? Uh... <laughs> I'll bet life is an unending torment for you guys. Actually, it's not so bad. Speak for yourself. I got one guy's okay with the other guy's like, no! Is there anything else you can tell us about your escape, Bigfoot? Well, he's a Bigfoot. He's escaped. He's a menace to society. What more could you possibly need to know? He's right, Sam. I don't think my colossal head could retain any more knowledge. <laughs> what can you tell us about Trixie? She's a very caring, sensitive young woman. If you care about that kind of stuff. She used to sing folk songs to the other freaks in her trailer. You ever heard a Scrantonese folk song? No. No. You don't want to. <laughs> oh, there was one other thing. She likes her men like the Statue of Liberty. Green and rusty? <laughs> Tall and dense. Dogged. Who are those guys we bumped into out by the gate? Uh, what guys? One was a short guy with big hair. The other one was a tall guy with big hands. Oh, you must be talking about internationally renowned recording star Conroy Bumpus. And his assistant, Lee Harvey. Bumpus? Who's Conroy Bumpus? Lee Harvey? He's a loon. Insane. And the country and western singer, The Boot. He actually wanted to buy Bruno and Trixie from us. Boy, was he steam when he found out that we didn't have them anymore. <laughs> Lee Harvey, isn't that, um... Is that the name of Two-Face? From Batman? Um... Why do I know that name? Harvey. No, that's Harvey Dent. Yeah, that's Harvey Dent. Lee Harvey, Harvey, uh, I don't know. And that's kind of a stretch there, plus bird. All right, anyway. Well, it's back to the Bigfoot hunt. Oh. Fun. Oh, look at the rubber ducky. I like the, I like the flatless birds. Trixie. It's the door to Trixie's trailer. Why a rat. That sounds like a country western song, Sam. <laughs> I can't pick that up. I can't pick that up. How do I... Oh. I better do something about that padlock first. Okay. Can I use uh, our little I friend here? I can't use these things together. I can't use these things together. Hmm. I can't use the Jesse J. I'll get rid of the padlock. I can't use these things together. It's one of those locks you can shoot a bullet through. Okay. No, really. Need I a gun? I can't talk. I think the lock's already being used to keep me from entering that trailer. Okay, I need a gun. It's a wholesome whack rat game. Whack a rat. Can we I play? can't pick that up. Aww. There we go. It's going to win. <laughs> I missed one somehow. A little bit harder to use with the mouse. I just love the fact that you can hit, uh, 
A little friend here. Hey, I got 34. Winner, winner. Yeah, smack those lips. I won something. What do we win? It's a wholesome whacker rat game with a prize in the dispenser slot. What is this? Flashlight? Hey, this crummy prize doesn't come with any light bulb. Oh, we have a light. It fits perfectly. It's a nifty flashlight equipped with a black light. So that will let me see what blood stains? I mean, it's not luminol, but it's one of those impossible to win carny games that have been ripping off the American <laughs> consumer for decades. I love capitalism. I love how uh, Mark Rober posted a video on how to win at carnival games. I think it was. It was really, really fun to watch. Oh, I just picked something up. What is this? It's a fishbowl magnifying lens. My head's already shaped like a fishbowl. <laughs> Can I use this and this? I can't use these things together. I can't use these. I can't use these. I, I can't use these things okay. together. I can't use these. I can't use the Jesse J. I can't use. I can't use these things together. Just trying to make I, sure. I can't, I can't use these things together. There's nothing I can't use. Just one of the things. You have to try everything. Can't look at that. Can't look at that. Looks like the entrance to the carnival is over there. Okay, so let's go this way. Oh, hello, cone of tragedy. Cone of tragedy. I bet they have four or five accidents a year on this ride. <laughs> Me? That's why it's called the cone of tragedy, I guess. Maybe we should ask the ride operator's permission to use this ride. If I didn't know that this guy was a highly skilled professional, I'd be very afraid. <laughs> He's not my type. Can we uh, max him? Use the, it's my look. I don't think he'd want that. Hey, tattoo boy. What? What can you tell me about life? It beats the alternative. <laughs> Whoa, you're a big boy. Now that's why I sit down all the time. Yeah, sure, that's why I sit down all the time. <laughs> what do you know about Bruno the Bigfoot? Who wants to know? We're the freelance police, and we're in a race against time. And we're barefoot. All I know about Bruno is what the Cushmans tell me. Well, that was useless. You might want to try the Tunnel of Love, though. Tunnel of Love. Rumor has it that one of Bruno's buddies hangs out in there. Hey, thanks, Let's man. Let's go, Sam. Oh, hush. Zach, I got more I want to ask. Do you have any idea what happened to Trixie? Trixie, the giraffe girl from Scranton? No, Trixie, the talkative... <laughs> She's my best customer. She used to ride the Cone of Tragedy for hours on end. I love the way her neck used to whip back and forth when I cranked it up to full speed. That's... Your sadism is a credit to your profession. <laughs> That's, yeah. That's creepy. Me and my partner want to ride the Cone of Tragedy. That's right. We've lost our will to live. <laughs> I'm not supposed to, but what the heck? You two look like a couple of caring, non-litigious mammals. Strap yourselves in, and I'll turn on the cone. Excellent. I'm sure nothing bad will happen. This is fine. Uh oh. Uh. Um. Yeah. <laughs> Oh my god. I'd be so sick. Oh, I, I, I would have passed out by now. Oh my god. <laughs> yeah, that'd be me. I'd be dead. <laughs> I'd just be dead. He's got a big smile on his face, though. I don't know how he does it. I, I would be so dead at that point. Ooh, I feel tragically empty. Me too. It's as though an integral part of my essence has been ripped from my being. <laughs> Let's do it again. Maybe later, chum. Alright, so we need to go to the Tunnel of Love. Which is... not sure where. A strength meter. 
I shudder to think of the number of promising dates cut short by this fiendish contraption. <laughs> I can't pick that up. I don't think I possess the psychotic strength needed to ring the bell. Hey, Max. What? Can you ring that bell? Sure. Do we use him as a sledgehammer? Oh. You're my hero, little buddy. <laughs> <laughs> I oh, just disappeared in a small tent. on toast. Nothing personal, but you're the single ugliest thing we've ever seen. Well, there was that computer game developers conference. <laughs> Have you lost something? I don't think so. Oh, someone in here. I've lost my youthful enthusiasm and boyish good looks. If you haven't lost anything, then get out of the water <laughs> fountain. Touchy. Why if we can talk to this guy now? Can you please put on a shirt? No. Anything else? <laughs> I bet you can't make your flames reach the top of the tent. Watch me, Jojo. Oh no. Tell me I just didn't burn down the tent. Okay, Anything good. Else? Could you show us something neat? Sure. That's pretty neat. Anything else? Are you sure you don't know anything about Conroy Bumpus? He is a country singer, right? Sorry, but I don't know much about him. I'm more of a mumbo fan. Anything else? Did you ever talk to Bruno before he escaped? How could I? He was in a block of ice. <laughs> That's a good point. What do you know about Trixie? Absolutely nothing. We never talked to each other. Ever. You see, he's pretty suspicious of it because he got fire. And the ice had to melt somehow, right? Uh, good. Like, right? Am I seeing too much into that? Or... Oh, look at the cloud trash can. Oh, it's a double love. It's so creepy. Tunnel of love. It's the creepiest tunnel of love I think I've ever seen. What's back here? I didn't even know there was a... Hey, what happened to my carefully collected box of useless junk? Wait, where all my stuff go? I lost it on the card of tragedy! It is a tragedy! Hey, Tattoo Boy. What? Ah, uh, yeah. Where'd all my cool junk go? It must have fallen out of your coat while you were on the ride. Here's a claim ticket. Take it to the lost and found. Okay. Kind of good that I accidentally uh, clicked on this box trying to get to the next area here, which I don't think I can do. I mean, I uh, I was able to come this way, but I can't seem. There we go. All right, we'll go to the last five second. I think this is the proverbial ugly swan that used to be a beautiful duckling. Look at that neck. Can't. We'll need a free pass. I can't use these things together. Free pass. How do I get a free pass? I can't use the... It's my little... I can't use these things together. We'll need a free pass. We'll need a free pass. Why would we need a free pass? It's just so weird. I thought we had free reign in this place. Oh yeah, let's go to Lost and Found now that we have a ticket. I still can't get over your incredible grotesqueness. <laughs> have you lost something? <laughs> I've lost a whole bunch of neat junk. Have you got a claim ticket? I do. Sure. Wait here while I search through the back room. How is there so much stuff in a little tent? Here's all the stuff we've collected off the Kono tragedy today. It's all yours. I feel whole again. Let's see. What the heck is this? It's a powerful refrigerator magnet that says World of Fish on its side. I wonder how that got in there. Yeah! Oh, hello. It opened up a, a new area for us. 
Hey, this means we can ride free all day. Oh, Does now we got the pass. About corn dog, Sam? Sorry, little buddy. Yeah, we didn't have the pass before because we lost it. That's why we couldn't go in the Tunnel of Love. Okay, that makes a lot more sense now. And because we found the, the fish magnet, we opened up the fish area. That's really clever. What's that stain? Uh, I don't want to know. Uh, so, free pass. I can't use these things together. So can I just use it now? Want to ride the tunnel? There we go. Yippee! This doesn't look like a tunnel of blood, though. <laughs> I'm in even the garden. Look, look around. Better to, would it be tacky to root for the snake? <laughs> would it be tacky to would it be tacky to would it be tacky to root, uh, I miss, be tacky to root for the snake? I missed the first line. I think it said uh, would it be better to how than uh servant heaven, which would be a uh, John Melton Paradise Lost line. Wow, a loving recreation of that Evelyn Morrison classic Revenge of the Gill Guy. <laughs> you really should get out more, Sam. Wasn't that a horror movie called like Revenge of the Fish People or something? So creepy, what are those? I can't talk to that. I can't use that from here. Uh another random acts of my <laughs> thank goodness today's leaders react more calmly to negative opinion polls. <laughs> Just another random acts of violence. Thank thank goodness today's leaders react more calmly to negative opinion polls. I don't know what I'm supposed to do here. So it reminds me of Monkey Island, uh, what, three? The, the thing moves slow. Which means I'm supposed to do something there. Well, that was fun. Just don't know what it is. Body's covered with swan pimples. There was someone I was supposed to talk to. Remember, there was a friend of... Why not? Of the... Of Trixie. be tacky to root for the snake I can't talk to that I can't talk to that I can't talk to I can't talk I can't use that from here okay I can't talk to that I can't talk to that I can't talk to that I can't use that from here I can't talk to I can't use that from here I can't use these things to get. I can't talk. To, I can't. I can't talk to that. Hmm. I can't. I can't talk to that. I can't. I can't. I can't, I can't talk. I, I can't. I can't talk to that. I'm good. I, I can't use. I can't use these things together. I can't use these. Thank goodness today's leaders react more calmly. To, I, I can't use these. I, I'm not sure. Acts of violence. Thank, thank goodness today's. I'm not sure what to do here. I mean, I know I have to go here to talk to the person, but I, I'm not. That ride continues to amuse me. I think we're supposed to do something in there, Sam. Yeah, I am. I just don't really know what to do. Do some blacklight, perhaps? I'm gonna go one more time. Let's ride the TOL again. If you insist. Go one more time and see if I can try using other objects. Because I'm definitely supposed to do something in here. Oh, look! Horn dogs! I can't I can't pick that up. I can't pick I can't pick that up from here. I can't use that from here. I can't use that from here. Bunny Elm, Bunny Elm, Mr. McGrady looks so much more lifelike now that he's dead. I can't talk to that. I can't use, I can't use that from here. I can't use these things together. I can't, I, I, I can't, I can't pick that up from here. Make the bats nervous. I can't 
can't, I can't pick, I can't, I can't pick that up. I can't talk to that. Can I have a magnet? Ah. I can't use these things together. Can't use these things together. Can you destroy the fuse box to stop this That's thing? Probably a good idea. Ah! Darn it! I, I think that was it. You're supposed to use Max uh, here. Or is it Sam? I'm, I'm still learning. This is the first time I've played any of these games. So forgive me if I mistake the two. Alright, fourth time through the Tunnel of Love. This time, I know I'll get it. Um, yeah, you kind of got stuck there for some strange reason. I'm beginning to get frustrated. <laughs> I'm sure there's something there. I'm sure there's two. I just missed it. Let's ride the fuel. Yeah, I, I just missed it is all. So I need to use this. Turn it on. Then I need to use this. To That's a good idea. Maybe I should try it when I'm a little closer to the fuse box. Hmm. I think it worked that time. Hey little buddy. Go wreck havoc. <laughs> oh my god! <laughs> He's trying to kick the axe. <laughs> I can't talk to that. Always trying to get the axe. This is a completely unusable thingamabob. This is a completely unusable thingamabob. I can't walk through this door. It's not real. But can I go on the other side, perhaps? Over here? Um... What am I supposed to do here? I can't pick that up. I can't pick that up. No, really. I can't pick that up. I can't pick that. I can't talk to that. I can't talk to that. I can't talk. I can't talk to that. Hmm. So I, I stopped the ride. But now. I can't use. I can't use these things together. I can't use these things together. I, I feel like it's right in front of me and I have no idea what it is and it's kind of frustrating because I should know exactly what to do here. It's a fuse box. I can't pick that up. I, I, can't, I can't talk to that. He looks a little busy. <laughs> I can't talk to that. Oh, there we go. See, I, I just couldn't do it because we kept getting in the way. Are you as confused as I am? <laughs> More so. <laughs> Oh wait, I am talking to him. Never mind. I'm excited. Who isn't? I didn't always want to be a cop, you know. Me neither. I wanted to be a hun. <laughs> I can see that. You're looking hale and hearty, little buddy. I'm a coffee achiever, Sam. I wonder where Bruno is. I'm still trying to figure out where I am, Sam. <laughs> I wonder where Trixie is. I shudder to think of the indignity she's suffering at the hands of that brute Bruno. I'm concerned about this Conroy Bumpus character. Don't worry, Sam. We'll mop up the floor with his cheap toupee. <laughs> so, nothing with... Well, that's all. I thought I was talking to this guy, but I wasn't. Let me see if he backs up. I can't talk to that. Can't. This is a completely unusable. I can't use these things together. I can't use these things together. Uh, what do I do here? I can't use these things together. I can't use these things together. Gotta be something obvious I'm missing. Just another random acts of violence. What's a random thing I'm missing? I can't talk to that. 
I can't talk to that. Here, maybe? This is a completely unusable thing. I can't use these things together. Why is it looking at that? Just another random acts of violence. Like, got the picture back here. Is something behind the picture, perhaps? I mean, I know there's supposed to be someone here I need to talk to. It's a cheap looking painting of a castle. I can't pick that up. I want you to knock it over. I mean, I can't use these things together. I can't. I can't use these things together. I can't use these things together. I can't use these things together. I can't pick that. No, really, I can't pick. I'm that thinking up. I had to Are pick up dense? the axe. I can't pick that up. Read my lips. I can't pick that up. I give up. Now you've done it. You've broken Sam's spirit with his stupid attempts to pick up that silly object. Oh my fact, god. If I didn't find his pitiful sobbing so amusing, I'd come out there and rip your limbs off. <laughs> oh my god. They actually build something like that in the game. I, I can't Just do anything. Just ignore now. them, Sam. Maybe they'll go away. <gasps> Just ignore them, Sam. Maybe they'll go All right, away. Alright, it's like now it's repeating. <gasps> Just I, I can't believe something like that exists in this game. That is wonderful. Just ignore them, Sam. Maybe they'll go away. But anyway, my name is Fuzz Bird. This is your Survey Scammer channel, and this is our blind let's play. Sam and Max hit the road for the PC. Uh, thank you for everything, my friends. I love you all so very much. Because this is the first video on the channel, I just ask humbly that you, uh, hit that thumbs up button to like the video. Uh, come consider subscribing if you, if you would like. Uh, it'd be great to have you on the channel. Comment in the comment section below about what you think about Sam and Max. Are you excited for this playthrough? Uh, or if it's your first time on the channel, just drop by and I, I would love to say hello to you and welcome you personally to the, uh, to what I like to call the number one YouTube community in all of YouTube because this is an amazing community. Uh, lastly, I do want to say thank you to our wonderful, amazing Patreons, Chenku T and Techno Trouble. Uh, I, I can't say enough. Thank you so very much for your support. If you'd like to support in any uh, way, links are in the description below. But until next time, my dear friends, so long and take care. Thank you for watching this video. Feel free to comment on what you saw and what you'd like to see next. I always love to hear your thoughts. But before we go, please remember that you matter and you are brilliant and you are loved and you should always be true to yourself. Never let the world tell you any different. Much love to you from your friendly, feathered, flightless bird.